Here is the former WBC lightweight champion of the world, presenting King Rai Ryan Garcia! Presentando el hijo de Parral, Chihuahua, México, la migraña. You know, for Oscar Duarte, round one that we saw when Ryan first came out. He's got it. That's a great body shot by Ryan Garcia. Mental may not be fired. Crowd already at full ball yes. like a bull. Yeah, that punch gonna be there. That uppercut, I told you. In the midsection of Ryan Garcia, and of course you can expect the speed. Surprisingly, Duarte has a lot of fans here tonight. Fighter, but he doesn't throw as he's coming in. He waits till his uh, uh, Duarte's uh, elbows are a little bit wide. I mean, uppercut here and there. Just touch. Against Ryan Garcia, he's got to throw punches. Can't get you stationary and throw that left hook around the guard right Think there. Think about Dorothy, he needs to see that punch. He won't throw it if he doesn't see it. He took advantage right there. There's the uppercut. He's going to be looking for that punch. The lee hand is going to work. That's atypical for Ryan Garcia. What do you make of it? You say, Sean, he should be content with just touching the glove, touching the jab, keeping it at bay. Yep. You saw the first knockdown against Javante Davis. Go to Duarte's body. Right hand on the... See, now he's stabbing him in the body. That's what's going to do it. Because it's one thing to be aggressive and throw a lot of punches against a special level. That means hitting him everywhere often, hot and heavy and ready for this, this fight. Now, the first thing you flash, the fast jab. with the shot. Two things that are going to wear Ryan down. Being in his face. The Angelo Keys. It's quite another thing to do it against the guy okay, with the gun. That's all you're going to get. Uh, right hand again and followed up. This. No one in this building is. Left hand. Ryan is such a reactive fighter. Right? Game plan for, for Oscar Duarte is to make Ryan Garcia out there from using his offense. What we got here, look at this, look at this. The pullback, hand down, sweeping left hook. Over. Southpaw caught Ryan with one of those shots, put a counter puncher in boxing today. So, Tank Davis is on a special Ryan Garcia. Yep, you see the reflexes, you see the speed. It kind of keeps you a little bit more at bay. Left to just missed. This is where Ryan doesn't want to be. Boys. Duarte said, I don't respect Ryan that much, but I do respect his peak. His... Duarte went away from throwing that right, that straight right to the Mia, threw a left hook from there. Yeah. Guys like him yeah, mentally, and then the body work that he's applying now, Duarte that day. He's over eager. Is he being patient enough? be good. Is he shot? There was a mistake. Right. Expose him. There's a left. to cut Ryan Garcia in half. Right hand for Duarte. He's his shots right now, you know, he, he's, he's taking his power shots. I come from the school of get, get what you can get. Hey, look, one thing about Tank Davis, he is pound for pound in the corner. He's got Ryan Garcia there, and he's not letting his hands go. Oh, Garcia. There you go. Straight back, and that right hand lowers when he pulls back. That's what they have. A little bit of draining mentally. That's because they cheating or, or no, no. And he told not to do it anymore. <laughs> to get to get off on him. Right here at the end of this round, we get a right, left hook and the right hand from Ryan Garcia. Four now, scheduled for 12. But he has not let his hands go. 40-36 in favor of Ryan Garcia. Make him feel defeated, and then you can defeat him. Not only that, but look, we wanted to make this a fight. Probably the 
the best round of the fight for Duarte. For Duarte, he's got Ryan in the corner. And Ryan looking to counter with the right hand or the right uppercut. Yeah. He's not committing to that That's jab. He does. It makes you think twice. And yeah. it takes you. He's urging him that he's falling behind. I think, you know, Ryan. Is... Yeah, I was going to say, I want Ryan to stay with what he's been doing. He got, you got to beat Duarte. Back on his opponent. Yeah, this is something I've really never seen before. Body structure. You know, Mayweather had a small head and white shoulders. He hit behind the biceps. For Garcia, who's constantly moving to avoid Duarte's pressure. Uh, so he's far. continuing to get me hit, hit there. Well, you've got to throw here. Like, these are the situations where you've got to throw six, seven, eight punch combinations for Duarte. Do something, and he let, needs to unleash and let those hands go. Not mentally, not physically. You beat him through it. Uh, it's because a fighter has pivoted. Good shot from the block. He took those punches good. Well, those are things you, you fighters aren't told. You can't just follow Ryan Garcia into the corner and do nothing. Look right there. That's what he's doing. Right, look, Duarte, that's twice now. Review in the U.S. and Canada. And you know both of those fighters. I need you to throw more punches, but you got to get closer. you got to throw punches close that distance. He's spelling it out for him. You've got to put more pressure, and you've got to let your hands go. He's been following Ryan Garcia around a lot. I was just going to say, this move that Ryan is doing, is, they think that they can do it. Ryan and the body work right there. Don't You know, he, yeah. he's alternating his feet. It's a weird him. angle that's happening right there in the, in the heat of the battle, in the moment. Through the guard. And just hitting anything. Hitting oh, the left hands, left hooks by Duarte. Sean, it's almost something an amateur would do. To... Garcia tried that, that Luke Campbell. Oh, yes. He used to do it. You understand what your opponent is doing. Shots, but you can bet Ryan Garcia's uh, feeling. Oh, I want to see how it's going to be like. Six, seven, and eight boxing ring to try to escape punches. Man, listen. A lead body shot didn't land cleanly. Nice pop. It passed me the DQ. And keeping those counter punches at bay. Garcia almost completely and they don't they've never been taught it. Yeah, that's something you got to it. And the reason Duarte is not letting go and unleashing those punches. Uh, to the right side by tilting that way. Round that's going to go in Duarte's favor. First momentum. Maybe not winning the round, but momentum. And Sergio, you know, when a fighter goes out there on his own devices, Usually like Garcia is content to make that. Garcia. Sticking and moving. Just, just not moving laterally shots and then go backwards and then pop that jab. Oh, he caught him coming in. But Duarte showing you he's got a very Next time Garcia does that shoulder roll, you can bet Oscar Glock. It's him getting comfortable in there. Shoot the right over there. Ah. He's getting comfortable. So far with Ryan Garcia. But yeah, I don't like that turn. It just doesn't look, it doesn't look right. When you, his defensive posture, Sean, this was going to be tough. He knew he was in for a fight. Maybe not this I agree time. With that scorecard, I, I do have one round going to, to, uh, to see a fight. And right now, it's not a style that he's fighting. So go. Nice left Great hand. advice. Oh, that uppercut scored big time for Garcia. Thanks, Dark. Back turn. I, I don't know, man. You can, I can't explain that. But here we are. I like the adjustment back to the game plan of marching out behind it. Yeah, seeing the shoulder roll, that's not something that I know Derek James to teach. As he fights back. I don't like it. I don't get it. I don't know why he's personally made that adjustment. Seven. Not bad. I, I agree with that scorecard uh, and jabbing using the speed. He says punch strong and hard. Make them move their feet. Nothing changed. I like it. I like it. I think it's, it's the right move to make right. reasons why. How effective are you in the fight in terms of getting through? There you go. There's a double. Oh, oh, oh. Me 
Green wants out. Duarte trying to shake him okay, up. But if momentum is going to Duarte's side. He's stopping him from hitting, so he's doing pretty good. He's, he's tough. He doesn't let very many people get through to him. No. As Duarte's trying to turn the tie. Duarte, he needs a double, triple, quadruple of that horse. Ryan Garcia is going to stay in the exact same pocket. Give him credit where credit's was, due. I was about to say, Duarte's upper body is... It's too strong. You're going to get the boomers out from the fans right now if you're moving that fans and how it looks. Hey! Hey, listen, keep boxing. Take your seat, take your seat. Listen, keep boxing. Yeah, I think we got it. See, we're seeing this ugly shoulder row. It's double hook. There's one, there's two. It's stop and pop, stop and pop. Get, take those this is not an engaging fight right now. That's on Ryan Garcia, but Oscar Duarte, to me, is not taking advantage like he should be. That's, I mean, the, 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 the head's covered. That's a given from his What's opponent. It? He just does not know how to punch his him out. That's when you attack him. When he's hunched over, coming forward, that's when he's going around. That's what I just said, and a lot more. Yeah. We see a lot of comparisons with Ryan Garcia and Oscar De La Hoya. Right now, we're seeing a version of Oscar De La Hoya. That's, that's most punchers. You know, that's that were actually praising Garcia's entrance. Fight he was winning. Yeah, at least the last couple of rounds of that fight. Land something big. Hey, Chris. Oh, nice look. <laughs> Come on now, I gotta get y'all to laugh sometime. But these are. Test that midsection. Only four of Ryan Garcia's 24 fights have gone the distance. These are largely wasted opportunities for Oscar Duarte. Continuous pressure of Oscar Duarte. You know, the, 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 the typical combination is. Nice slipped in there from. Two minutes, 51 seconds, round number eight. Your winner by way of knockdown, King Ryan! Ryan.